Hello kids, welcome to the maths class. Today we will do the topic ordinal numbers. In last video we have discussed what are ordinal numbers and we have done ordinal numbers from 1 till 10 on the copy. And the main objective of today's learning is to write and learn ordinal numbers from 11 till 20 on copy. Now let us revise what we have learnt about ordinal numbers till now. Numbers are divided into two parts, cardinal number and ordinal number. A cardinal number is a number that says how many of something there are such as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 etc. Whereas an ordinal number is a number that tells the position of something in a list such as 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th etc. When we want to count the number of footballs that how many footballs are there like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 these counting numbers are called cardinal numbers. Or if we want to find out that in which position they stood up in the race, like red one has come first, the blue one has come second, the green one has come third, the yellow one has come fourth and the orange one has come fifth. So the numbers which shows the position or order of something are called ordinal numbers. Now let us practice ordinal numbers from 11 till 20 on copy. As you can see that I have divided again this page into three parts. In first part we will write the cardinal numbers from 11 till 20. In second part we will write their ordinal numbers and in third part we will write the short form. So the first cardinal number here we will write is 11. And the ordinal number of 11 is 11th. For that first we will write the spellings of 11. So spell 11 with me. E-L-E-V-E-N. 11. And we will add T-H and it will become 11th. And the short form again first we will write 11. And then we will add last two letters that is th and we will write it in the next box and it will again become 11th now after 11 what comes 12 and the ordinal number of 12 is 12 but for that we will not write spellings of 12 here the spellings are changed here we will write t w e l F in place of V E we will write F and then we will add T H and it will become 12th. Now again the short form is first we will write 12 and then we will add last two letters that is T H. Now next is 13 and the ordinal number of 13 is 13th. So first we will write the spellings of 13. So spell 13 with me. T-H-I-R-T-E-E-N 13 and again we will add T-H. It will become 13th and again the short form is like 13 and add last two letters. That is T-H and it will become 13th. Now after 13 what comes? 14. So we will write 14 under cardinal numbers and the ordinal number of 14 is 14th. So spell 14 with me. First we will write the spellings of 14. F-O-U-R-T-E-E-N 14 and then we will add T-H. It will become 14th. And again we will write 14 and we will add last two letters and it will become 14th. Now after 14 we will write here 15 
and the ordinal number of 15 is 15th so first we will write the spellings of 15 F I F T E E N 15 and then we will add T H and it will become 15th and again in the short form first we will write 15 and then we will add last two letters that is TH and we will write here in the next box and it will become 15th now what comes after 15? 16 and the ordinal number of 16 is 16th so first we will write the spellings of 16 SIX T E E N 16 and we will add T H and it will become 16th and again in the short form first we will write 16 and again we will add last two letters T H now after 16 17 and the ordinal number of 17 is 17 so first we will write 17 spell 17 with me S E V E N T E E N T H 17th and again in the short form we will write 17 and add T H now after 17 18 now ordinal number of 18 is 18th so first spell 18 with me E I G H T E E N and add T H so it will become 18th and the short form again 18 and add T H 18th now after 18 what will come 19 and the ordinal number of 19 is 19th so first we will write the spellings of 19 N I N E T E E N T H 19th and the short form is 19 and add th now after 19 20 and the ordinal number of 20 is 20th so we will write the spellings of 20th t w e n t i e T H 20th and the short form is 2020 and add last two digits that is T H and it will become 20th. Now let us do exercises of ordinal numbers. Now we will read the exercise first write ordinal number of here cardinal numbers are given and we have to change that cardinal numbers into ordinal number number one is 12 and what is the ordinal number of 12 12th so first we will write the spellings of 12th t w e l f t h and how we will write the short form of 12th first we will write 1 to 12 and then add th now next is 9 and the ordinal number of 9 is 9th so first write 9th n i n t h and the short form is 9 and add th next is 20 and the ordinal number of 20 is 20th so first we will write the spellings of 20th t w e n t i e t h 20th and the short form is 20 
and th next is 14 and the ordinal number of 14 is 14th so first we will write the spellings of 14 f o u r t e e n 14 and add t h and the short form is 14 and add t h next is 6 and the ordinal number of 6 is 6th first we will write spellings of 6 s i x and we will add t h and it will become 6th and the short form of 6th is 6 and t h now next exercise is write cardinal number of now the ordinal numbers are given and we have to write their cardinal number number one is 17th how we will write the cardinal number of 17th the cardinal number of 17th is 17 we can write spellings of 17 like s e v e n t e e n 17 or we can write 17 in numbers also like 1 and 7 17 next is 11th and the cardinal number of 11th is 11 e l e v e n 11 and how we will write 11 in numbers 1 1 11 next is 10th and the cardinal number of 10th is 10 so first we will write the spellings of 10 that is t e n 10 and how we will write 10 in number 1 0 10 now next cardinal number we have to write is 5th and the cardinal number of 5th is 5 f i v e 5 and in numbers 5 now next is 19th the cardinal number of 19th is 19 n i n e t e e n 19 and we can write 19 in numbers also like 1 9 19 now let's recall what we have learned today. We have learned how to write ordinal numbers from 11 till 20 in words on copy. Now children I hope you all understood how to write ordinal numbers from 11 till 20 on copy and how to solve their exercises also. So open your maths book, maths copy and snap homework and do the related sums. Thank you.